This is the 0.01% chance Dragon Breath animated sticker, also known as 1 in 10,000 odds. Today we're going to try and get a successful trade for the rarest item to exist in Adopt Me. Starting off, we're in a very rich server. Our first offer consists of a bunch of Mega Neon Pets. But the thing is, I actually already have all of these Mega Neon Pets. So I'm going to say no thank you to this, as there's none that I'm really interested in. We're going to try and find out what some really cool pets are. So let's see if we can go and get anything. We're going to be going and setting up a stand first, as this will help us to go and show to everyone what this brand new item looks like. So we're going to go up to the stand and then go and press select item. And then I think it should let me stick it in the stand. Let's see, it's back to front. Brilliant, of course, that went really well. I like the fact that it's actually animated in the trade as well. That's a really nice addition that I really wasn't actually expecting a dummy to go and have as a feature. So that's a cool little added bonus. This person's offering me a Mega Fly Ride Red Panda. Again, I already have these pets. These are pets that I'm not really looking for. I'm hoping that I can get a high tier mega neon pet. Definitely difficult to go and get. I am not really after any of these. So we're gonna go and say, no, thank you. I've already got these pets. We are looking for something rare, something exotic, something that I don't have. For example, a frost dragon. I gave away all of my frost dragons in giveaways. So I now have nothing left to go and keep for myself. But the fact that this is one in 10,000 means it would literally cost you so much bucks to go and open. I mean, if you were to go and open it yourself, it would cost you over 2.5 million bucks, which just kind of shows you how expensive this actually is. But the question is, do people actually want to trade for this thing? Of course, it's gonna be really difficult to find someone who has a ton of Mega Neons and wants to try and get the Dragon Breath sticker. I am hoping that we can go and get some Neon or Mega Neon Legendary Pets for this. I have just seen someone online who's actually offered a parrot for one of these things, which is kind of crazy that a pet sticker is literally worth a parrot. This person said they're a fan, so let's say thank you and hopefully we can go and find someone who wants this extremely rare, expensive dragon breath sticker. Hopefully someone wants it. I know a bunch of YouTubers are going to want it. I've just got messages from some of them. Great, this person has offered me a sandwich, but I did post this online and someone's actually just offered me a frost dragon for the animated dragon sticker. They're offering me a Skelly Rex, which seems like these trades are progressively getting worse. This person has a Mega Fly Ride Arctic Fox, which is actually one of my favorite pets to be fair. This is, although it's an ultra rare, it's actually really difficult to go and get. So do I accept this? Um, I actually don't know. The fact that someone literally offered me a frost dragon and a parrot online means that we can probably get something a little bit better than the mega arc. I spotted some person with a neon bat dragon, which is really cool. Imagine if we could get something that good. It's actually really difficult to find someone who wants to trade for this as not many people actually know the true value. This person is offering me a mega goldfish, a just a diamond dragon, a guardian lion, a squid, nice fun little pet, and a bunch of random other ads, but we paid a lot more than uh, this offer. So I'm gonna say no thank you, because I definitely overpaid and I'm looking to try and get something a little bit similar to what I traded for this sticker. A ride ancient dragon and a ride frost fury. Earlier, we were getting mega frost furies as offers. I think already this has decreased in value as more people are slowly going and getting this. This thing has definitely dropped a ton in value. I think I traded with a giant overpay on this. They added a Mega Neon Ice Moth Dragon. This is such a difficult pet to trade and no one is offering for it. I'm gonna hit accept. I have no idea if they're gonna follow through with this trade. They hit decline. I thought that was gonna happen. But the fact this is literally 1 in 10,000, I don't think people really understand that, like, to know how much is worth, to be fair. They've added some interesting things, such as a neon white Amazon is actually a really rare pet, believe it or not. But the other things I do have. So we're gonna see if they can go and do anything else. I've asked if they'd swap the white Amazon out, see if we can get something pretty similar in value. They'll put a neon follow, dude. Hmm, I've got a ton of that. 
the neon Amazon was worth like a hundred times more. Asked if they have any other sort of offer for this. They changed it into a neon fly ride chameleon, which is kind of fun. See, this is actually probably a pretty good deal. I would be making a win. This is a neon chameleon, which is really difficult to go and get. A mega rock is a nice old pet. A mega neon bally starling is also pretty cool. And then we're also getting a diamond griffin. So I'm not sure if I should accept this. I'm going to temporarily say that I'll uh, see what some other offers are. If we uh, don't get any other better deals, we'll go back to them basically. A parrot. They are not going to accept a parrot. I'm going to hit accept on a parrot. I think this is definitely a troll trade. There's a bunch of these troll trades going on. I think that's definitely going to be a troll. I'm going to hit confirm. I do not think they're going to hit accept on this. I've seen lots of people go and offer this and then just hit decline straight after. Um, they're definitely thinking about it. There's a bunch of reactions. A parrot, very valuable. But I don't think they're going to accept it for a 1 in 10,000 dragon breath sticker. This did cost 2.5 million bucks worth. So I think I'm going to do it. I think they're probably going to hit the client. They're definitely thinking on it. They're going to 100% hit the client in a second. And they hit the client. That was so hopeful. They, they spent so long thinking about trading that parrot. All right. That I thought they were going to hit accept on it. We did just get offered a bunch of random like neons and megas, but none of these are really ones that we want. All right, this person has just added a bunch of very rare pets. I think they're going to say um, any offers for my pets. I thought they were offering all of that for this. I'm just going to say offer me. People are thinking that they are offering all of these pets for the sticker, um, which is kind of crazy that um, people think that. This person's offered me a Mega Ride Kirin, which although it's a good pet, definitely doesn't top off the offers we got earlier. This person is now, however, going in adding some other legendaries, including a Striped Eggie, Robodog, Griffin, and a King Bee. But none of that combined is worth what we're looking for. This is an interesting one. We just got offered a cow and a dodo. The cows do have a lot of value in them. Everyone loves how a cow looks. And we also got a dodo and two golden hamsters is pretty valuable. But this is probably a pretty fair trade, but not really the pets that I'm after. Since I've already got a mega neon cow and a mega dodo, so I don't really want these pets. This person has a neon fly ride Dalmatian and a mega unicorn, but I don't think they're offering. Offering me a princess monkey, a black chow chow, and a guardian lion with a couple of urban eggs. A fly ride zombie buffalo is a cool looking pet. Gold mahi is nice. A guardian lion, a zombie buffalo plush. That's not one that you see that often. That's probably pretty fair. Honestly, I don't really know the values on these toys and the zombies. I've spent over an hour trying to trade this sticker. I kid you not, nobody wants this. Well, they do, but I'm just not getting like good deals for it. Technically, everyone actually wants this. This person's offering me a kangaroo river, which is a doll. Yeah, not many people talk about the dolls anymore. I think everyone kind of forgot that they actually existed in Adopt Me. I am now slightly regretting not accepting that neon chameleon trade that we got earlier because I probably should have taken that when I had a win because this is definitely dropping in value by the minute. This person offered me a mega 2021 uplift butterfly. I now swapped server into a different, very rich server to see if we go and get any other trade offers. They have a mega fly ride gargoyle. I don't know if they're gonna accept this. If they do, then that's probably a win. And they did hit decline on it, unfortunately. Someone has just hit accept on a neon fly ride um, monkey. I don't think they're going to follow through with this trade. If they do, I will be so happy. I think they're trolling with me, though. The amount of troll trades we have had, very likely this is going to be a troll, to be honest. We'll find out. Um, they're definitely taking their time. Normally, if someone takes their time this long, it's uh it means that they're gonna go and hit decline on it and they would definitely be a bit over in terms of value and they did a rainbow dragon their username says mega frost i would happily take that a mega ghost although it's fun it's really not worth much okay this is actually a very interesting offer i'm gonna hit accept on this i'm not sure if they're actually going to or not 
I think this one probably is going to be, a, again, a bit of a troll. Four, five Neon Legendaries. I don't think they will follow through with this trade. If they do, great. I'm going to hit accept. This one's probably a troll. We have had so many troll trades. Will we go and get it? Five Neon Legendaries. Let's have a look. Um, probably not. Let's see, though. They're definitely taking a long time to decide. People in the chat are saying, don't do it. Um, help me, should I do it? Um, someone's saying that they shouldn't. Alright, they, they, I want my trade, they should do it. Someone said that they shouldn't do it, so, um, I guess they're probably gonna hit the decline. There is a lot of people spectating this trade. And they declined because of the spectation tool. If they didn't have spectate, then they probably would have, uh, uh, got accepted. Again, we're getting so many troll offers. This is 100% going to be a troll adding a mega fly ride shark with a seven second countdown. Will they go and hit accept? I don't think they will. I'm going to hit confirm. I don't think that this person will. They actually hit confirm. Oh my word, that took so long. Oh my word. So we ended up getting a Neon Fly Ride Phoenix and a Mega Fly Ride Shark. That took me over an hour worth of trades. Let me know if that was a win, fair or a loss. I did originally trade an Arctic Reindeer with a Ride Potion on it, so I think that's probably pretty good. Click here to see me open 100 sticker packs in Adopt Me. I think you're gonna like this video next, so click here right now to go and watch it if you haven't already. And make sure you subscribe with notifications to help join the Cookie Cutter Squad and get to 1 million.